Hey everyone, thanks for checking out the video. I'm JP and this is Good Talk HQ. In today's episode, we'll take a look at some of the best deals that you can find right now for under $5 on the Nintendo Switch eShop. And at the end, I'll let you know how to enter this week's giveaway. If you've been here before, as always, I'd like to welcome you back to the show. You're absolutely the best community on YouTube, hands down. Thank you so much. And if you're new here, please consider joining our extended family here at the channel. We cover Nintendo Switch content every week and we live stream with our viewers so we can all hang out and play some video games together. We'd love to welcome you as well. Either way though, please enjoy the video. Alright, let's start with a robot named Fight. This is an action platformer for one or two players offline from Morningstar Game Studio and offers players roughly 9 to 10 hours of main story gameplay. Now the story follows a lone robot tasked with stopping an evil mega beast from invading and it features a procedurally generated world which is ever changing and there are millions of map layouts. It also features some amazing retro graphics and sound, plus there's loads of secrets and unlockables to find and the controls felt great. If you're interested make sure to check out a robot named Fight before the sale ends on September 9th, it's marked down 85% to just $199. Next we have Secondoid. This is a single player retro style shoot 'em up that will take players roughly 3 or 4 hours to finish up. This is an ultimate homage to retro arcade twin stick shooters, featuring an 8 bit aesthetic and a bumping soundtrack, all wrapped up in a black and white presentation. Players will have to fight off evil robots and save the Equinox from destruction. But you also get a free bonus game with the purchase, it's called Yugatron, which itself offers another 50 plus levels, plus power ups, multiple control schemes, all that good stuff. This is a great value currently on sale for $199, it's marked down 90% until September 13 at an all time low. Smoke and Sacrifice This is a single player narrative driven RPG from Curve Digital with a main story that will last roughly 15 to 20 hours to finish up. In this one players will have to craft, fight, survive and explore this huge open world in this beautifully hand painted adventure with some unique characters all of whom have a story to tell. The story itself follows a young mother who has to sacrifice her firstborn child and sees us setting out on an adventure to uncover the dark secrets of what has actually happened to her son. The game features beautiful graphics and an outstanding soundtrack. The story is engaging and the controls are straightforward. If you're interested in Smoke and Sacrifice, make sure to grab it up before the sale ends on September 9th. It's marked down 75% to an all-time low of just $4.99. Debris Infinity. This is a top-down arcade-style shooter from SBC Games, this time offering both single-player and multiplayer action and a story that will last a couple of hours. This game has a very unique look and it really can put your reflexes to the test. But the game itself offers three different main game modes. They're all playable with a friend or solo, but one really unique feature is how they implemented the multiplayer itself. Basically, one person will be controlling and steering the ship while the other is in control of the ship's weapons, making communication your key to success. And if co-op isn't your thing, there's even a versus mode as well. Make sure if you're interested to check it out before the sale ends on September 6th, it's marked down 25% to just 374. Next we have Earth Atlantis. This is a single player shoot 'em up from Head Up Games and will take roughly 3 or 4 hours to complete. In Earth Atlantis, most of the Earth itself is flooded and is underwater and the machines have risen to power over the humans. We play as a hunter on a mission to clear the seas of these hybrid marine machines. Now again this is a side scrolling shoot 'em up but it's all about monster hunting and features a unique graphical style. They call it old sketching but basically everything just looks like it was drawn with a pencil and it's beautiful on the Switch. The music is calming and relaxing and overall this is a great time. If you're interested in Earth Atlantis, make sure to check it out again before the sale ends on September 13th. It's marked down 87% to an all time low of $199. Next we have Wandersong. This is a single player 2D platformer with a heavy emphasis on music. This one comes to us from Humble Games and offers a main campaign that will last roughly 9 or 10 hours. As I was saying, the game has a heavy emphasis on music and singing. You play as this goofy young bard and you use music to interact with things along your journey. The game features an impressive cast of characters that you'll meet along the way with some pretty neat little puzzles to solve and some of the most colorful graphics on any game that I've seen on the console. The story was very emotional and surprisingly good. Make sure to check this one out before the sale ends on September 10th. It's marked down 75% to an all time low of just $4.99. Donut County is one of the most unique games on the list. It's a charming little single player puzzle style game and it comes to us from Annapurna Interactive with a main story that will last roughly 2 or 3 hours. This is a physics based game where you play as a sinkhole in the ground that grows bigger and bigger with each victim. The story was pretty funny and the main plot centers around raccoons that have created this remote control hole that can steal people's food and belongings. You can even use the sinkhole to catapult items into different areas of the level and on occasion it will help solve puzzles. 
If you like funny little puzzle style games, make sure to grab this one up. It's part of the sale until August 30th. It's marked down 70% to an all time low of just $389. Alright, next we have Hue. This is a single player 2D puzzle platformer from Curve Digital with a main story that will last 4-6 to six hours. In Hue, players explore a grey land in an attempt to find color fragments as you seek to locate your missing mom. The unique feature here is that you can alter the color of the background and any obstacle or object that matches that color will disappear. This will allow you to clear different paths and progress further. The world in Hue is alive with characters and they're interesting and each one has a unique story to tell. The developers even included a colorblind mode to make the game accessible for more players. This really is a good game and it's a great value when it's on sale so if you're interested in picking this one up make sure to do so before September 9th it's marked down 80% to an all time low just $199. The Flame and the Flood is a single player adventure with a pixel art aesthetic and a transformative soundtrack. Published by Curve Digital, this game offers a main story that will last roughly 15 hours, even more for completionists. You'll travel both on foot and by raft as a young girl with her canine pal down a procedurally generated river. Players will need to gather materials, craft tools, and keep themselves in good health in the harsh wilderness. You'll also have to learn to deal with the wildlife as well, as not all animals you'll come across will be friendly. The Switch version features all of the enhancements that were made over time and the game is definitely worth checking out. If you're interested in Flame in the Flood Complete Edition, make sure to do so before the sale ends on September 9th. It's marked down 75% to an all-time low of just $374. Alright, next we have one of our favorites, Strikey Sisters. This is a Brick Breaker style game with a fantasy theme for 1-2 to two players in local co-op and the main story is quite substantial all things considered, clocking in around 4-6 to six hours and even more for completionists. This game is amazing and while it's just a Brick Breaker game at heart, it's cleverly disguised behind a wonderful charming and engaging story with amazing pixel art graphics and even some cutscenes. There are multiple difficulty levels, boss battles, power ups and collectibles and the game has so much replayability it's a no brainer for under $3. If you're interested in Strikey Sisters, make sure to check it out again before the sale ends on September 16th. It's marked down 70% to an all-time low of just $2.99. Deadly Days. This is a single-player strategy game from publisher Assemble Entertainment and offers a main story campaign that will take players roughly 8 hours to complete. Now this is a unique game set in the zombie apocalypse and has us take control of a group of survivors and we must scavenge for food and supplies in a constant struggle to stay alive day to day. As you progress and become a stronger group, you'll eventually seek the source of the outbreak in an attempt to put an end to the invasion. The cast of playable characters is large and varied, with special attacks and abilities, the cities and missions are procedurally generated to keep things fresh, and the pixel art is once again top notch. You'll be able to get Deadly Days right now on sale at an all time low until September 1st, marked down 80% to just $379. Blazing Beaks. This is a twin stick shooter, once again from Cubic Games, designed for 1 to 4 players in local co op with a main campaign that will take players roughly 10 to 12 hours to wrap up. Now, as I've said before, this is a comedic spin on the genre and doesn't take itself too seriously. And while the name is unassuming, it's a great game. You have 10 playable characters, a few different game modes, all which can be played by yourself or with a group of friends locally. The dungeons are randomly generated to keep things fresh and there's loads of upgrades to find, but be careful, greed is a dangerous thing in this game. If you're a fan of twin stick shooters or finding yourself starting to really get into the genre, make sure to check this one out while it's on sale until September 7th. It's marked down 87% to an all time low of just $199. Next we have Ali Ali Switch Dance. This is a collection of arcade style multiplayer games from Gambitious Studios and offers a main story that should last players roughly 15 to 20 hours combined. With this package you'll get the original as well as Ali Ali 2 Welcome to Hollywood. The games offer multiplayer action for up to 4 players offline but unfortunately there's no online options as of yet. Now these games are all about racking up the highest score while pulling off as many of the over 100 tricks in the game as you can before the end of the level. Combined there are more than 5 unique environments, 50 plus levels, and more than 250 challenges to work your way through. There are even multiple game modes, so if you're interested in this collection make sure to grab it up before the sale ends on August 31st. It's currently marked down 80% to an all time low of just $299. Wrecked is an arcade style racing game from Cubic Games and offers local co-op for up to 4 players. Now this game is all about pulling off awesome stunts behind the wheel and with Wreck doing tricks and stunts is incredibly smooth and easy. You can also pull off sick combos from one trick or ramp to the next for some awesome point bonuses. The game features 3 main areas to roam around in, more than 50 unlockable cars, loads of challenges and multiplayer action as I stated before. 
As a matter of fact, the multiplayer modes add a few extra arenas to drive around and explore. Now this is another game that's part of the Cubic Games secret sale. In fact, many of the games are less than a dollar. However, if you haven't purchased one of their games before, such as Coloring Book, the price for Wrecked right now is $1.99 marked down 67% until September 7th. Alright, next we have One Strike. This is a single player arcade style fighter from Cubic Games that really won't last long story wise, but you'll be unable to put it down anyway. This is an absolute blast and feels like an old school arcade game where you'd put a quarter in and play until you die. The premise of the game is that when people would duel with deadly weapons historically, they wouldn't be long drawn out battles. One deadly fatal blow and that was it. So as you may have guessed, in one strike you can only withstand one deadly strike and the same goes for your opponent. The art style used and sound were really top notch once again and I would highly recommend a playthrough of this at least once. Right now it's on sale with the Rise of the Dragons DLC which added 3 new characters for just $2.98 but the base game is $1.99 until September 7th marked down 60%. This is also again part of the secret sale which again I'll explain here in just a few minutes. Butcher. This is a fast paced single player 2D platform shooter that will take players roughly 2 or 3 hours to complete. Now Butcher is a love letter to classic platform shooters from the 80s and has an amazing soundtrack that will get you pumped up to kill waves of enemies. The game is all about brutal action and it delivers one of the most challenging experiences I've had thus far. The enemies are all trying to kill you and so are the stages, so reflexes will certainly be put to the test with this one. This is truly one of my favorite games, we stream the entire thing here in one session on the channel. I highly recommend this one, if you're interested, make sure to check it out before the sale ends on August 30th, it's marked down 60% to just $3.99, definitely worth it. Atomic Run Gun Jump Gun is a single player action platformer from Gambitious and this one is tough as nails so it's hard to place how much time you'll get out of this game. I mean this one was designed to kick you till you're down and then kick you some more. The control scheme is simple, one button shoots downward to propel you up, the other shoots forward to blast enemies. The thing is the game is fast and there's no stopping so you'll have to constantly balance these two weapons almost in a rhythmic fashion as you learn the levels. The game offers more than 100 different levels across 3 unique environments and a few different game modes as well. There are even online leaderboards if you're into that sort of thing. This is a wild game and if you're interested it's on sale until August 31st for just $1.99 marked down 75%. Next we have Invisigun. This is an arcade style party game from Sombra Studios and offers local multiplayer for up to 4 players with online upping that even further to 6 players. This is the ultimate stealth battle game where everyone is invisible and it's all about risk versus reward. Vigilance is key as you have to use the environmental tells such as footprints and other little disturbances to point out where your enemies are standing. There are a ton of awesome environments, maps, and game modes with some really cool abilities to unlock as well. The replayability here is off the charts. The game even offers single player campaign modes as well. So if you like the look of the game but you would prefer to play solo, that's another option. This is another one of the easy to learn but tough to master type games, but if you're interested make sure to pick it up before the sale ends on September 2nd, marked down 90% to just $1.99. Tiny Lands. This is an extremely peaceful puzzle game, once again from Cubic Games and offers roughly 4-5 to five hours of gameplay. Do you remember those old books where you'd have two images side by side and you'd have to spot the difference? Well this is pretty much the same thing just with a 3D environment. You'll have two diorama style mini worlds side by side that you can rotate and move around for different views and you'll have to spot the differences in each one. Now while it sounds simple, it pretty much is. The game is a wonderful experience and the music is outstanding and has a tendency to just kind of pull you in. This is a great game for a quick session before bed to unwind after a long day. If you're looking for a great little puzzle game, please consider Tiny Lands while it's on sale until September 7th. It's marked down 50% to an all-time low of just $2.99. Figment. This is a single-player 3D isometric adventure game with some action elements thrown into the mix. The main story will take players roughly 5-7 to seven hours to complete. Firstly, I have to say the hand-painted world and the peaceful soundtrack were the biggest draw for me to the game. I had always heard great things and I'm glad I gave it a try. The gameplay is very similar to Bastion or Transistor if you played those games before. The whole game takes place inside the mind of a young man who's been in an accident and falls into a coma, so we must play out the events of the man's imagination and solve the random puzzles along the way. Right now Figment is on sale until August 30th, marked down 87% to an all time low of just $2.59, be sure to check it out. We have Hard West. This is a single player adventure RPG from Forever Entertainment with a main story that should last players roughly 20 to 30 hours making it a great deal for its current sale price. The game features a unique open world set in the wild west, compelling turn based combat with a wide array of weapons and upgrades and a story that is affected by every decision you make throughout, oh yeah, and some magic. See this version of the old west has magic, cults, and spells to go along with the standard weaponry. 
One really cool feature is the ability to ricochet bullets around obstacles by shooting at something metal. This game is wild and the story is amazing. If you're interested in Hard West, make sure to check it out before the sale ends on September 2nd. It's currently marked down 90% to an all-time low of just $1.99. Definitely worth checking out. Metaloid Origin This is a single-player, fast-paced, run-and-gun shooter from developer Retro Revolution with a main story that will last players roughly 4 or 5 hours. We take on the role of one of the three playable characters to dash or blast our way through the nine different stages in an attempt to thwart the invading robot army. The game is often compared to Mega Man X or Metal Gal, and it does feel a lot like those titles. The controls are tight, the graphics and sound go well with the gameplay, and overall it's just a fun time, especially when on sale. There are some minor translation issues, but nothing that will break the immersion for those who only speak English. If you like these tough side-scrolling shooters, make sure to grab this one up before the sale ends on September 5th. It's marked down 50% to just $3.49, which is again an all-time low. Pixboy this is a retro 2D platformer from Forever Entertainment and will take players around 4-5 to five hours to finish up. This is an absolute retro arcade platformer stripped right out of the 90s. In fact, it looks, feels, and sounds just like a Game Boy game. The coolest part aside from the gameplay, of course, are the graphics. You can actually find and collect over 20 graphical skins which will change from Game Boy to Commodore 64 and many more. The game offers more than 40 levels, hundreds of secret rooms, and of course some great platforming action. Make sure to give this one a serious look before the sale ends on September 2nd. It's marked down to just $1.99, which is 60% off and an all-time low. Alright, next we have Phantom Doctrine. This is a single-player strategy RPG from Forever Entertainment offering more than 50 hours of gameplay. This is an immersive story interweaving multiple historical events and characters to bring to life a reality of the harsh Cold War from a unique perspective. Featuring next-gen turn-based combat for flexible movement and actions, an expanded battlefield allowing players to call in reinforcement during battles, and again a 50-hour campaign, there is so much value here. It's currently available for 90% off marked down to just $1.99 until September 2nd, which is an all-time low and a good reason to check it out. Alright, next we have Super Chariot. This is a charming and cute platform game for one or two players in local co-op and offers more than 20 hours of gameplay, all of which was designed specifically for the Nintendo Switch to be played either by yourself or with a friend. The unique feature in this one is that you'll have to carry along the wheeled coffin of the Dead King throughout all of the 25 levels and 5 beautiful environments. The gameplay itself reminds me a lot of Yoku, just without the pinball mechanics. There are a few level types too, which was a nice change of pace from time to time, and the clever way they implemented the puzzles to make use of the cart is pretty fun to experience. If you're a fan of tough, challenging platformers, or interested in this one, make sure to grab it up before September 2nd. It's marked down to $1.99, 87% off. Next we have They Bleed Pixels. This is a single player 2D action platformer from Spooky Squid Games Incorporated, and offers a main story that should last players roughly 12 to 15 hours. The story itself centers around a young female protagonist struggling with her inner demons. Now the gameplay does a great job of balancing acrobatic platforming with the simple one butt combat system, however the game also rewards players for using more cleverly timed and precise attacks in rhythm with the beat of the soundtrack. See if you do it right, the game gives you checkpoints that you can use like an item. This will give you the freedom to place them wherever you want during the levels. The game looks nice and feels amazing to play, it sounds great as well, and it's definitely a recommendation this week as it's currently on sale until September 2nd, marked down 87% to just $1.99. I think at that price, it's worth checking out. Okay, let's go over the Cubit Game Secret Sale. In order to take advantage of this special offer, all you have to do is go to the Nintendo eShop and download Coloring Book, which is free. Once you've downloaded Coloring Book, again, which is free, a whole bunch of other games will become available at a huge discount. Now, you don't have to purchase Coloring Book if you've already purchased one of their other titles. I only mention Coloring Book because it's free, it's cool for little kids, and it will qualify you for all of the discounts. Games like Mana Spark, Blazing Beaks, Dex, Zombie Blast Crew, they all drop to under $2 and some under a dollar. In fact, there's more than 60 games on sale from the list right now, so have fun and go crazy. If you want to access their game list on the eShop, you can open up any of their games or search for Cubit Games in the search bar. It's an amazing sale, so be sure to check it out. Oh yeah, and make sure you tell a friend about the deal as well so they can save some money.
all right folks that's going to go ahead and wrap up this episode if you made it this far thank you as always for watching and hanging out with us for a few minutes again today we appreciate and value your time so again thank you for the new folks, please consider subscribing to join our extended family. We do eShop gift card giveaways. All you have to do to enter is just be subbed to the channel, leave a like on the video and comment on any of the eShop sales videos throughout the week so I can find your name and put you on the current list. Either way though, we hope you had a good time. Please stay safe out there and we'll let little man take us home as always. Bye everyone. That's all for today's list. We hope you liked the video. If you did, consider subscribing and liking down below. Okay, bye!